McAteer. McAteer with the cross. There's the goal. Robbie Keane. One nil. That was brilliant Irish play. Right from the moment. Welcome to the Soccer Super Skills CD-ROM. Some of the most exciting moments for football supporters are those times when a player produces a moment of sheer magic to bring the crowd to their feet. We all remember great moments from the great players like Ronaldo and Zidane, but Irish players can produce those moments too. Just think about a neat footwork from players like Damien Duff and Robbie Keane. On this CD-ROM, our players will demonstrate some of these super skills and show how you can perform them in easy to learn steps. We'll also show you advanced ball control exercises and juggling moves, which will definitely bring more enjoyment to your practice and your games. By using these skills and putting in the right amount of practice time, you can lighten up your match with moments of brilliance. I hope you enjoy the CD, and more importantly, I hope you find time to practice. After all, you're the future of Irish football. This is a slick interchange of contact with the football from the outside to the inside of the foot in one fluid movement. It's a particular favourite of the Brazilian star, Ronaldinho. Approach the defender as if pushing the ball to your right side with the outside of your right foot. As the defender is dragged towards the ball, transfer the ball to your right instep in one fluid movement. Accelerate away to your left, leaving the defender going the wrong way. A favourite of many players, including Ronaldo and JJ Okosha, the use of the sole of the foot is the key to this one. While the step over leg both confuses the defender as to the direction you're going and also acts as a shield for the ball. Here, Kevin Kilban shows how it's done. Approach the defender, touching the ball slightly to the outside of your right foot and make sure you're on your toes. Drag the ball across the front of your body using only the sole of your right foot. As the ball is travelling across the path of your body, step back across and over it with your left foot and accelerate away to your left off your left foot. Brazil's Denilson used this move in the final moments of the World Cup final. It's a particular favourite of Roberto Carlos and Ryan Giggs. It fools the defender into thinking he's recovered the ground to get back goal side. However, you will chop the ball inside into the space left, opening up other options for you. Run with the ball with the defender running alongside you on the inside. Slow down to let the defender get slightly ahead of you. Swing your leg back as if about to cross the ball. As the defender stretches to block the cross, chop the ball inside behind your standing leg and accelerate away to the inside off your standing leg. The purpose of a step over is to fool the defender into thinking you are going to attack the space on one side and you know that you are going to accelerate the opposite way. Step overs are used often by Damien Duff and Robbie Keane. Run directly at the defender, controlling the ball with the outside toes of your right foot. 
Around two yards from the defender, swing your right foot around the outside of the ball, keeping it as low to the ground as possible and fooling the defender into thinking you're going to the right. When the right foot goes around the ball, drop your right shoulder and bend your right knee to emphasize the illusion that you're going right. Accelerate away to your left and using your right leg to power away at pace. This is a move made famous by Dutch legend Johan Cruyff and is still a very popular move among the more skillful players of today. It's a move normally used in wide attacking positions and is used frequently by Irish striker Damien Duff. Shape your body as if to cross the ball with your right foot from the left wing. Instead of crossing, drag the ball with the area of your foot between the big toe and instep back behind your standing left leg. While the defender attempts to block your cross, you quickly adjust your feet to accelerate away from the defender down the touchline. This is a slick move requiring precision timing and quick feet and always looks good. Juggle the ball until you comfortably have it under control and are ready to perform the move. Tap the ball up with your right foot. As the ball is dropping, throw your left foot over it. In the same movement as the ball drops, hop off your right foot, let the ball drop back down onto your right foot again. Tap it upwards and readjust your feet to continue juggling. 